Hi everyone, how are you today? I hope you are fine. I hope you are good. I hope you are okay. I hope you are excited for this new lesson. So for today we're going to start working with vocabulary about the city, okay? The city. Uh, we're going to learn vocabulary about places, occupations, um, transportation, okay, vehicles, and workplaces, okay, about jobs. The first place that we're going to look for is, you know, as you can see in the picture, it is the park. The park, okay? That is the park, okay? There are some trees, okay, um, some playground. Uh, as you know, the park is really exciting, you know, especially for the weekend. Here is the hospital. Hospital, okay? As you can see, that is the door, that is the front, okay? And as you can see there, it says emergency, okay? So, maybe you can find out for a doctor or maybe a nurse, okay? Or a dentist. Okay, here we have the airport. Airport. As you can see here in the picture, there are lots of airplanes, okay? Airplanes. Um, they are at the airport and... As you can see, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, so many airplanes, okay? Airplanes in the airport. Airport. Okay, here we have the train station and the bus station. Train station and the bus station station. In the train station maybe you can go to visit to one of your uh, family members, okay, that is nearer to your town. Or in the bus station maybe you can take a bus and travel across the city. And maybe you can go to the school, or maybe you can go to the hospital, or maybe you can go to the shopping mall, okay? That looks really exciting. So, here we have the train station and the bus station. Okay, here we have the subway station. The subway station, okay? The subway station is down, okay? It's down. You have to go downstairs, okay, in the city to maybe travel across the country, okay? For maybe to your work. Or maybe if you want to go to the shopping mall. For example, here there is only a subway station in Santiago. Okay? In Santiago there is a subway station. Okay? Subway station. Here we have the police station. And of course, the police officer, okay, works here, okay, in the police station. This is another place that we can find out in the city. Police station. Okay, there is the fire station. The fire station. At the fire station, maybe we can find out some um, people that's going to help us. Those people are the firefighters, okay? They are going to help us when we need help, okay, in our houses, okay? Especially if we are in danger. So, there is the firefighters, okay? That live or used to live in the fire station. Fire station, okay? Okay, here we have the municipality. At the municipality or maybe the city hall, okay? The city hall is the same thing, okay? 
es lo mismo, ok, it's the same thing, municipality or a city hall. So, at the municipality, maybe we can find out there are some politicians, ok, and politicians, ok, maybe help us uh, all in the community, ok? So, if you have a problem in the community, ok, politicians are going to help us at the city hall, ok? City Hall. Okay, here we have the shopping mall, okay? The mall. At the shopping mall, maybe we can find out some places such as um, the cinema or maybe some drugstores or the supermarket or some restaurants, okay? And you can visit this place with your family or your friends, okay? Um, as you can see in the picture, there are a lot of people there, okay? And you can buy some things that you need, okay? At the mall or shopping mall. Here we have the cinema, okay? The cinema. This is a very fun place, okay? You can watch movies here with your family or your friends, okay? In the cinema. Cinema. Okay, here we have the supermarket. The supermarket. In the supermarket, you can buy, okay, a lot of things that you need for your house. Especially, okay, food or some things that maybe you need, okay? You can find out uh, your bread, your food, or your fruits, your vegetables, or some rice, um, some use, ice cream, or whatever you want to buy at the supermarket, okay? In the supermarket. Okay, let's go now with the drugstore, okay? The drugstore, okay? The drugstore is the same thing as the pharmacy, okay? But Americans, okay, uh, and English people used to call it just drugstore. Drugstore, okay? So, drugstore is the same, es lo mismo que pharmacy, okay? Pharmacy, farmacia. So, this is the drugstore, okay? In the drugstore, maybe you can find out some things that you can buy, such as, um, you know, medicines or um, maybe a shampoo or a soap that maybe you need for your bathroom or, I don't know, a toothbrush or a toothpaste, okay? Or whatever you need for this uh, store. So here we have the drugstore. The drugstore, okay? Remember that. Okay, this looks so delicious, okay? This is a bakery shop. The bakery shop. In the bakery shop, obviously, we can buy some cakes, um, bread, different type of breads, um, it looks so yummy, you know? You can shop a lot of things. Um, maybe some empanadas or sopaipillas. Okay, you can buy that at the bakery shop. The bakery shop. Okay, kids, this is so fun because this is the zoo the zoo and at the zoo maybe we can find out some animals such as you can see in the picture uh, a tiger a koala a kangaroo or a blue butterfly okay that is flying in the back okay there are some kids there running and of course there is a family there it looks so beautiful okay so, the zoo is an amazing place to visit. So, let's go to the zoo. The 
the Okay, here we have the museum. The museum. Okay, the museums always are very interesting places, okay? We can find out so many things here. Because you can find out, okay, um, all the stuff, okay, or new stuff, okay, in the future. You can go back in the past and go further in the future, okay? So... Um, the museum, it's a very interesting and historical place, okay? This is the museum, museum. Here we have the library, library. In the library, you can maybe borrow some books, okay? And you can read always quiet, okay? Always you have to be quiet, shh, quiet, if you want to go to the library, okay? Because there are a lot of people that needs to read or study here, okay? In the library. There are a lot of books for any subject you need. For example, for um, history or for science, art or English books, okay, if you want. This is the library. Library. Okay, here we have the school. The school. In the school, of course, you go to study, okay? And you can make some friends. And there are a lot of teachers for any subject, okay? So, this is the school. The school Okay, here we have some exercises. What you have to do here is that you have to complete the blank space with a place that you like and the other blank space with a place that you don't like, okay? So now in Spanish. Okay, lo que tienes que hacer acá básicamente es Agregar en el espacio indicado, ok, con el pulgar hacia arriba, indicando un lugar positivo que te guste, ok. Por ejemplo, la oración dice, I like going to the, me gusta ir a, y al lado escribes entonces o agregas el lugar que te gusta visitar. Luego tenemos abajo, I don't like going to the, no me gusta ir a, ok, tienes entonces el icono de, el pulgar hacia abajo que no te gusta visitar ese lugar. So, maybe for example you can say I like going to the zoo. I like going to the zoo. And you can say if you don't like something I don't like going to the shopping mall. I don't like going to the shopping mall. ¿Ok? I like and I don't like. Okay, kids, now we're going to start working with uh, transportation, okay? And vehicles, okay? So let's talk about that now. Okay, let's go now with... The first vehicle is car. Car. That is a blue car. The next one is bicycle. Bicycle. Or maybe you just can say bike. Bike. Bicycle. Bike. That is a red bike. Ben and school ban. That is a white ban and a yellow school ban. Ban or school ban. Bass. Bass. 
That is a yellow bus. You can travel through the city or across the country by bus. Travel by bus. Train. Train. That is a long white train. That is a long white train. Motorcycle. That is a motorcycle. I can ride a motorcycle. Lorry. Or maybe you just can say truck. Lorry or truck. Es lo mismo. Lorry or truck. Camión. Okay, here we have airplane. Airplane. You can travel across the country through an airplane. Or maybe you can travel around the world in an airplane. Airplanes are at the airport. Airplane. Okay, here we have a boat. A little light blue boat, okay, in the sea, and that is a big ship, okay, a ship, a big ship, okay, in the sea, okay, traveling across the ocean, ship, and a little boat, okay, boat and ship. Helicopter. You can fly in an helicopter. Rocket. Rocket. You can travel to space through a rocket. Okay? You can travel to space in a rocket. Rocket. Okay, walking by foot. We can go walking by foot. Walk by foot. Caminar a pie. Walking by foot. Okay, here we have some exercises. Okay, for example, I can say, I go by car. I go by car. And the first exercise says, I go to the, here we're going to add a place, by, and then we're going to add a bagel, okay? So now, in Spanish. Lo que vamos a hacer acá básicamente va a ser agregar primero un lugar a donde queramos ir y luego vamos a agregar el medio de transporte en el cual vamos a llegar a ese lugar. So, for example, I can say, I go to the mall by bus. I go to the mall by bus. Then you have to do the other exercises. Okay, let's go now with occupations, okay? Um, occupations are basically related with jobs, okay, or professions, okay? For example, some occupations we have here are artist, doctor, nurse, mechanic, farmer, or reporter. Artist, doctor, nurse, mechanic, farmer, reporter. So, this is very important, so we have to remember and learn. Job, in Spanish, means trabajo. It's according to the, el puesto de trabajo, okay? 
Work is trabajar. La acción de trabajar. ¿Ok? Work. Trabajar. La acción. Work. Then we have a profession. Lo que estudiaste para trabajar. ¿Ok? En la universidad. Esa es tu profesión. Then we have the occupation. That is what you do in your job. ¿Ok? Lo que haces en tu trabajo. So here we have job. El trabajo en sí. Work. La acción de trabajar. Profession. La especialidad que estudiamos para realizar el trabajo. In occupation. Que es lo que hacemos, ok, en el trabajo. Ok. Job. Work. Profession. And occupation. Ok. Remember always that. Here we have some other um, occupations, ok, or professions. We have firefighter, dentist, doctor, singer, director, police officer, painter, architect, chef, or teacher. Ok, so now we're going to find out Where these people work, okay? Okay, at the hospital, there are some people that can work there, okay? We can find out uh, some people that work there, some professions or occupations such as doctor or nurse. Doctor or nurse, okay? Doctor, nurse. They work in the hospital. In the police station, obviously, the police officer, okay? It could be a policeman or a policewoman, okay? But basically, it's the police officer. The police officer works in the police station. And at the fire station, okay, we can find out that the firefighter works in the fire station, the firefighter, police officer, firefighter. Um, we can find out here, for example, in the school works the teacher, and in the library or the museum, for example, uh, we can find out some professions such as the secretary or the office worker, okay? Okay, let's do some exercises here, okay? For example, it says, um, I want to be a, okay, here you have to put the profession, okay, or the occupation you would like to be when you get older, and I want to work in a, here you have to put the place that you want to work when you get older, okay, according, obviously, with the profession. So, now in Spanish. En este ejercicio, básicamente, lo que tienes que hacer es agregar primero la profesión y luego el lugar de acuerdo a esa profesión o oficio. Por ejemplo, el primer ejercicio dice I want to be a... Yo quiero ser tal profesión. Luego dice I want to work in a... Yo quiero trabajar en un o una... Y ahí agregas el lugar de trabajo. For example, I am a teacher, so I, I'm going to say, I want to be a teacher. I want to work in a school. I want to be a teacher, and I want to work in a school. Let's go with the next slide. Okay, guys, here we have a lot of professions and occupations, okay? For example, we have doctor, chef, um, teacher, scientist, um, pilot, uh, firefighter, um, farmer, plumber, um, painter or artist, 
astronaut, a uh, mechanic, um, singer, what else? A lot of professions, okay? Maybe a lawyer. And so, stay tuned for another videos. I hope you like this one and see you in the next one, okay? So, goodbye!